British singer and songwriter Brian Johnson is best known for his role as a member of the rock band ACDC. Known for his distinctive voice and strong Geordie AC scent, Brian Johnson has played a pivotal role in the success of ACDC. The band is known for popular tracks such as Highway to Hell, You Shook Me All Night Long, Let There Be Rock, It's a Long Way to the Top, Back in Black, Thunderstruck among others. He joined the band after the death of Bon Scott. Prior to joining the band, he was a founding member of the rock band Jordy. The move to join ACDC was a good move as he enjoyed mainstream success. As of 2024, he has an estimated net worth of $90 million, making him one of the richest rock stars in the world. In this video, we shall have a look at Brian Johnson wealth, wife, children, career, mansions, cars, and relationships. Give us a like and subscribe to our channel to watch other interesting videos. Brian Johnson was born on August 22, 1947 in Dunstan in County Durham. His father Alan Johnson was a coal miner and sergeant major in the British Army. His mother Esther Johnson was of Italian descent. His parents divorced when he was a child and was raised by his stepfather who owned a trucking company. He attended Dunstan Hill School. Following in his father's footsteps, Johnson also served in the Parachute Regiment of the Territorial Army at a young age. His love affair with rock and roll began at a young age, listening to records by artists like Little Richard, Elvis Presley, and Jerry Lee Lewis. Inspired by their raw energy and charisma, Johnson dreamt of one day making his mark in the music industry. In the late 1960s, Johnson took his first steps towards realizing his musical ambitions by joining his first band, the Jasper Hart Band. Though short-lived, this experience laid the groundwork for Johnson's future endeavors in music. It wasn't long before he found himself at the forefront of another band called Gobi Desert Canoe Club, a name as eccentric as their musical style. Gobi Desert Canoe Club, while not achieving significant commercial success, provided Johnson with valuable experience as a performer and songwriter. The band's eclectic mix of blues, rock, and psychedelic influences allowed Johnson to hone his craft and develop his own unique vocal style. However, it was Johnson's next venture that would serve as a crucial stepping stone towards superstardom. In 1972, he joined forces with fellow musicians in his hometown of Newcastle to form the rock band Geordie. Named after the colloquial term for a person from the Tyneside region, Geordie quickly gained traction on the local music scene with their energetic live performances and catchy songs. Under Johnson's dynamic leadership, Geordie released a string of albums that showcased their raw talent and infectious energy. Tracks like Don't Do That, All Because of You, and Can You Do It solidified Geordie's reputation as one of the most promising bands to emerge from the northeast of England. Despite their regional success, Geordie struggled to break into the mainstream, prompting Johnson to explore other opportunities. Little did he know that fate had something extraordinary in store for him. In 1980, tragedy struck the world of rock when ACDC's lead vocalist, Bon Scott, tragically passed away. In the wake of Scott's untimely death, ACDC found themselves at a crossroads, desperately in need of a new frontman to carry on a legacy of high-voltage rock and roll. Recommended by friends in the music industry, Johnson auditioned for ACDC and immediately impressed the band with his powerful vocals and magnetic stage presence. His audition performance of Whole Lotta Rosie left no doubt in the minds of the band members that they had found their new lead singer. Joining ACDC was a dream come true for Johnson, who had long admired the band's electrifying sound and rebellious spirit. With his addition, ACDC underwent a seamless transition, and Johnson's fiery vocals injected new life into the band's music. Johnson made his debut with ACDC on the iconic album Back in Black, released in 1980. The album, dedicated to Bon Scott's memory, became an instant classic, catapulting ACDC to new heights of fame and fortune. Johnson's gritty vocals on tracks like You Shook Me All Night Long and the title track Back in Black became anthems for a generation of rock fans. Throughout the 1980s and beyond, Johnson continued to front ACDC with unwavering energy and passion. 
Albums like For Those About to Rock We Salute You, The Razor's Edge, and Black K Ice cemented ACDC status as one of the greatest rock bands of all time. With Johnson's distinctive voice serving as their sonic signature, under Johnson's tenure, ACDC achieved numerous milestones and accolades, including induction into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 2003. Their electrifying live performances and timeless hits have earned them a dedicated global fan base that spans generations. Despite facing challenges along the way, including Johnson's temporary departure from the band due to hearing issues, ACDC persevered and continued to rock audiences around the world. Johnson's resilience and unwavering commitment to his craft have made him a revered figure in the world of rock music, inspiring countless aspiring musicians to chase their dreams. Brian Johnson's journey from his early days in Geordie to his legendary status as the frontman of ACDC is a testament to the power of passion, perseverance, and the unbridled spirit of rock and roll. With his unmistakable voice and boundless energy, Johnson has left an indelible mark on the music world that will resonate for generations to come. Brian Johnson Relationships Brian Johnson has been romantically linked to several beautiful women. Let's have a look at his wives, girlfriends, and baby mamas. Brenda Johnson is the wife of Brian Johnson. Brian Johnson, the iconic frontman of ACDC, enjoys a fulfilling family life alongside his wife, Brenda Johnson, and their children. The couple has been happily married since 1990. Brenda, a former flight attendant and model, has since established herself as a successful entrepreneur, owning and managing several businesses, including a restaurant and a clothing boutique. Their family expanded with the arrival of their son, Braden, born in 1997. Additionally, Ryder, welcomed into the family through adoption in 2017, contributes to the joy and love shared within the Johnson household. Notably, Ryder joined the family from Brian's second marriage to Jennifer Louise Johnson. Brenda stands as a staunch supporter of her husband's illustrious career, often gracing his concerts and public appearances with her presence. Her close friendship with the other members of ACDC further strengthens the bond within the extended musical family. Brenda's dedication to both her family and her husband's career underscores the harmonious balance they maintain in their lives. Brian Johnson's former wife is Carol Johnson. They tied the knot in 1968 and were blessed with two daughters, Joanne, born in the same year, and Kala, born in 1973. Both daughters followed their passion for music, while Braden pursued a career as a professional surfer. Ryder, their youngest, is still a child. Unfortunately, after a lengthy marriage, Brian and Carol decided to part ways, finalizing their divorce in 1987, coinciding with the writing of the Razor's Edge album. Despite the separation, Carol remained a devoted mother and wife during Brian's tenure with ACDC. The reasons behind their divorce remain private, known only to the couple. Despite this, they maintain an amicable relationship, driven by their strong commitment to their daughters and grandchildren. Presently, Carol enjoys her retirement in Newcastle, England, cherishing moments with her family and friends. She actively supports various charitable causes as a patron, adding positivity to her community. Kala Johnson, the daughter of renowned ACDC frontman Brian Johnson, was born in 1973. Following in her father's footsteps, Kala has embraced her family's musical heritage and pursued her passion for music. Kala is known for her captivating performances and soulful voice, captivating audiences with her unique blend of rock, blues, and folk influences. Whether performing solo or collaborating with other artists, Kala's music resonates with authenticity and emotion, reflecting her personal experiences and artistic vision. Beyond her musical endeavors, Kala is also involved in various philanthropic efforts, using her platform to raise awareness for causes close to her heart. With her talent, passion, and compassion, Kala Johnson continues to make her mark on the music industry and beyond. Joanne Johnson, born in 1968, is the eldest daughter of legendary ACDC front man Brian Johnson. From a young age, Joanne showed a natural inclination towards music, inspired by her father's rock and roll lifestyle. 
Harnessing her innate talent and passion, she embarked on a musical journey of her own, pursuing her dreams with unwavering determination. Today, Joanne is a respected musician in her own right, known for her soulful vocals and dynamic stage presence. Whether performing solo or collaborating with other artists, she captivates audiences with her heartfelt performances and infectious energy. Real Estate Brian Johnson is a proud owner of a house in Sarasota, Florida. He paid $690,000 for this waterfront property in 1991. He constructed an 8,000-square-foot mansion on the property. This mansion boasts spacious living areas spread across its 8,000 square feet, offering ample room for relaxation and entertainment. From grand living rooms to cozy lounges, every space is meticulously designed for comfort and style. The luxurious master suite is a sanctuary of indulgence, featuring a spacious bedroom, a private sitting area, and a lavish and soot bathroom with a soaking tub and a walk-in shower. A private balcony or terrace offers stunning views of the surrounding landscape. With multiple guest bedrooms and in soot bathrooms, this mansion ensures that visitors are treated to the same level of luxury and comfort as the homeowners. EACH Guest Suite is thoughtfully appointed, providing a peaceful retreat for overnight guests. From a state-of-the-art home theater to a game room equipped with billiards and arcade games, this mansion offers endless entertainment options for residents and their guests. Outdoor amenities such as a swimming pool, spa, and outdoor kitchen further enhance the entertainment experience. The Florida lifestyle is best enjoyed outdoors, and this mansion offers exceptional outdoor living spaces. A sprawling patio or terrace E overlooks lush landscaping and may include features such as a fireplace, seating areas, and a built-in barbecue grill. Thanks for watching. Subscribe.